in these streets. And I'm just like you. We getting locked by these cows. And I'm just like you. We fulfill the prophecies. And I'm just like you. You might be light, I might be dark. But I'm just like you. We kill each other over colors. And I'm just like you. I'm in these ghettos, in these slums. And I'm just like you. They call you nigga, call me spit. And I'm just like you. You were 1619, I was 1492. We getting shot in these streets. And I'm just like you. We getting locked by these cows. Welcome to FCN Quick News of the Week. I am your host, Captain Zakar, and this week in the news, we have 39 abducted or kidnapped children found in the state of Georgia. Let's read that article for us. U.S. Marshals recovered 39 missing children in two-week operation in Georgia. Go down. Let's go down on that. Let's, let's read that paragraph. In a two-week search for endangered missing children in Georgia, Dubbed Operation Not Forgotten, the U.S. Marshals Service said Thursday that they, would, that they recovered 39 children and arrested several individuals in connection with their disappearance, including persons who had sex offender violations. Let's go to the next image there. Let's get straight to the points in that article. Let's read that. According to the U.S. Department of Justice, child sex trafficking is a problem at risk. American children are currently facing as they are recruited and exploited for commercial sex. And that is, that is more prevalent and especially going on in the black and Hispanic uh, community. There's high numbers of our children being kidnapped during this time right now. During the Rona, uh, the whole social justice uh, movement, black and Hispanic kids are suffering in high numbers for being kidnapped and exploited for commercial sex. Let's read on. Let's see who's doing that. Pimps and traffickers, uh -huh. said the agency, sexually exploit children through street prostitution and in adult nightclubs. How are kids in adult... Now, nobody notices that these kids are in adult nightclubs? Let's read on. Illegal bro brothels, uh -huh. Uh -huh. sex parties, motel rooms, hotel rooms, and other locations throughout the U.S. Let's, let's go to the next image. Let's finish out this article here. Read that for us. Many of these children are usually homeless, runaway, or throwaway youth who often come from low-income families. When they say low-income, you know who they're referring to generally, like blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, right? Read on. This population is seen as an easy target by pimps. Because the children are generally vulnerable, uh -huh. without dependable guardians, and suffer from low self-esteem. Victims of the prostitution of children, however, come from all backgrounds in terms of class, uh -huh. race, and geography. The DOJ, which is the Department of Justice. Justice. Let's go to Sirach chapter 32 and verse 22. And God, because God, this is the book of life, and he has answers for kids to, to not be abducted or, or sold into sex trafficking and, and prostitution. Read that. Sirach 32, 22. Sirach, chapter 32 and verse 22. Uh -huh. And beware of thine own children. God tells us to beware of our own children. You ought to know where your children are at all times, and especially when they are teenage kids, when they get a little bit more freedom and you relax a little bit because they know how to handle themselves on a day-to-day -day basis, but God says, beware of thine own children. Let's go to 1 Peter 5 and 8 to see why God tells a parent to beware of thine own children. Know where they at. 1 Peter 5 and verse 8. Uh -huh. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary the devil, uh -huh. as a roaring lion, walketh about, seeking whom he may devour. Satan is going rampant throughout the earth, seeking whom he may devour. And it may be kids that suffer from low self-esteem or kids that come from low-income neighborhoods. So you have to mind your children before Satan gets them. And now and they're in a situation that they don't know how to get out of themselves unless they are found somehow by someone like in that uh, Operation Not Forgotten thing by the U.S. Marshals. Let's go to Matthew 24 and 12 to, to show why that kids will, are being kidnapped and, and things of that nature. You have to watch out for them. Why is that happening in today's time? Read that. Matthew chapter 24 and verse 12. Uh -huh. 
And because iniquity shall abound. Iniquity is sin. Go ahead. The love of many uh -huh. shall wax cold. In the last days, the love for one another shall wax cold. And why is that? Because the laws of God are not taught in the earth today except by the Israelites. So the love of many has waxed cold where they will abduct small children, teenage children, adolescent children, and abuse their bodies just for some money. Let's go to 1 Timothy chapter 1. And let's read verse 9 and 10. First Timothy chapter 1, verse 9 uh -huh. and verse 10. 10. Uh -huh. Knowing this, that the law is not made for a righteous man. The law is not made for a man that's righteous because he's doing what he's supposed to do. Read on. But for the lawless uh -huh. and disobedient, uh -huh. for the ungodly and for the sinners. Read. For unholy and profane, for murderers. Uh-huh. Of fathers and murderers of mothers. And what else? For manslayers. Uh huh. For whoremongers. For whoremongers. For them that defile themselves with mankind. Read. For men stealers. For who? For men stealers. For men stealers. AKA kidnappers. The law is made for those people that would think to kidnap a child and sell them into prostitution. To traffic them from one person to another. Let's go to Sirach chapter 42 and 11. Now, you saw on the article, if we could pull that back up real quickly. Let's pull that back up. And uh, let's scroll down to the bottom. Let's scroll all the way to the bottom. Yep. Keep going. Uh, go back up some. Right there. This population. This population is seen as an easy target by pimps because the children are generally vulnerable uh -huh. without dependable guardians and suffer from low self-esteem. suffer from low self-esteem and don't have dependable guardians. So some of those children that are uh, sex trafficked and kidnapped, they are not, uh, quote unquote, snatched off the street. They actually want to uh, see what it's like to live that kind of lifestyle before they are ready to do that. Give me it in Sirach chapter 42, and let's read verse 11. Sirach chapter 42 and verse 11. Read. Keep a sure watch over a shameless daughter. And so you got to keep a sure watch over a shameless daughter, one that is sexually promiscuous. Right? Read. Lest she make thee a laughing stock uh -huh. to thine enemies, uh -huh. and a byword in the city, uh -huh. and a reproach among the people. A reproach among the people. Why? Because... She didn't get kidnapped. She ran away and chose to do those things. So you may have to watch over a shameless daughter if they have that type of spirit on them. Give me that in Ephesians chapter 6, and let's read 1 through 4. Ephesians chapter 6 and verse 1. Uh huh. Children, obey your parents. Children should obey their parents. Read. In the Lord. Uh huh. For this is right. Honor thy father and mother, uh -huh. which is the first commandment with promise. It's, that promise is what? Read. That it may be well with thee, and thou mayest live long on the earth. Obeying your parents will, uh, equals to long life because you are being disciplined. God is watching over a child that listens to their parents. Read on. Servants. Sorry. And ye fathers, uh -huh. provoke not your children to wrath. To God's wrath. Read. But bring them up in the, new, in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. That admonition of the Lord is what? The commandments of God. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold, from Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how we're men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. 
IUIC, we deliver the truth.